I want to start by uh, expressing our police department's very deep sorrow over the finding of Riley today. And we are with his parents. I think they know that and we'll continue to be with them in the days and weeks ahead in our thoughts and prayers. I want to start this afternoon by introducing Riley's father, Ryan Gilbert. Uh, thank you all for being here and those of you that help us keep Riley's face in front of the cameras. Um, you've helped us get some closure here and let us take our boy home. Um, I got a lot of people to thank and I'm sure I'll forget somebody. Uh, you won't be forgotten. I'll, I'll remember you. The whole family will remember you. But uh, I want to first thank the uh, NMPD for their efforts. They've had a lot of sleepless nights on this case as well. Uh, can't give them enough thanks. Uh, really appreciate the work they've done. Uh, the United Cajun Navy has come in to assist them. Uh, they've they've done a lot of a lot of work on the water and land for us. Uh, came in and gave structure to this investigation on our side of it, and helped keep things lined out. Uh, Dave Flag here with the United Cajun Navy. They've been a great asset great asset to us. Um, the individuals in the area that have come in contact with us that have helped us uh, with numerous things, gathering supplies and. Uh, taking care of stuff like that, putting up flyers and whatnot. The Ward family, for all their work, uh, they put up a ton of flyers around town. They've been making phone calls. They've been assisting us in any way they can. Um, all the people that have donated items to them that they've got to us throughout this whole ordeal. All the people back home in our own personal lives that have been there to support us and our family at home as well. Uh, thank you for keeping us in your thoughts and prayers. We can't say enough to all of you. Thank you. Oh, I wanted to mention uh, also uh, Gary and or Skip, Skip. Skip. Skip Butler uh, come in with the airboats. Uh, we've been on the water for a few days with those guys. They've been uh, they've been great to work with us. We can't appreciate we can't thank them any more than just unbelievable what they've done for us. Most of you are familiar with seeing my face by now. I'm sure we're all ready for it to be over with. It's been an emotional roller coaster. We're quite thankful for everything that you've done for our family. The grace that you've given us, it means a lot more than you'll ever know. We have learned through this ordeal that everybody has brought all the good to us. We've had a little bad. You're going to have that. But it has given us faith in people that sometimes gets clouded by what we're constantly hearing. We're extremely thankful for all the volunteers that have shown up, given us their time, their effort, their energy very little sleep they've gone on our family we can't thank our family enough for all the support that they've provided us for all the you know time spent the love the energy our friends that we consider family that aren't able to be here but have been at home caring to everything that we can't take take care of thank you to the people of Nashville I can't thank you enough for the support the love the encouragement that you've shown myself and my wife and Ryan and Millie you don't understand how much that meant to us in some of our darkest hours the hugs the prayers the offers. I can't say it enough. Thank you. To the Nashville Police Department. We know this hasn't been easy. We've tried to handle it with as much grace and poise as we can. 
it's hard. It's never quick enough when it's your, your family member. Like I told everybody numerous times, if he was two blocks away from us and they were walking him to us, it wasn't quick enough. We want him two inches in front of us. So thank you for everything that you've done for us. It's greatly appreciated. Thank you. I just want to reiterate um, how thankful we are for everyone and how much we appreciate everyone's support and love and prayers because we feel them. We have felt every one of them, every single one. I just ask that you mamas out there hug your babies tight tonight, please. Please, for me, just hug your babies tight tonight. And again, thank you. Thank you for sharing our story. Yeah, I'm not going to take a lot of time. Most of what I would say would just to be to echo what's already been said. Outside of that, I would like to extend my thanks to the media community here and uh, the national media community who far and uh, by large has been very gracious and very respectful, respectful of the situation. Um, it's something that has not frequently been encountered in these situations in my experience. Um, as far as the Cajun Navy goes, since this is going to be a, a more or less a short interlude, if there is any interest in it, we would be happy to uh, hold another meeting with the press and it will likely be tomorrow sometime. Um, best place would probably be the public park where we first met. And you can let me know afterwards if there's interest in that. We'd be happy to help you. Thank you.